I just wanted to do a quick video about my truck build. Uh, this is a 1972 C10 step side. Uh, originally it had a 350 um, motor in it, but I decided to go with the LS route. This is out of, actually out of a 2014 Camaro. So it's a 6.2 liter L99. And so I've done a lot of custom stuff to it. Uh, the motor only had 200 miles on it when it um, when the car was wrecked, so it does have the six-speed automatic transmission. And I'll go into uh, in other de uh, videos about some different mods that I had to do. But I did put a Whipple on it. Um, I do have an entropy uh, radiator. I did have to do a custom mounting for the intercooler radiator on here in the front. Since this was the uh, Camaro kit I used for the Whipple, uh, some custom hose routing, long tube headers, uh, a custom intercooler re reservoir here that I had made, and I'll go more into that later. Uh, the body work was done by Insane Hot Rods in uh, Tennessee. There's a lot of custom work on this cab. It's in primer. It still needs some light body work, but there's no rust. They did a great job on it. And, uh, I'll say more about that later. Show you some of the cab work. I had to cut the inside to fit the transmission. But I'll do another video on specifics. Um, I do have a rear end. Uh, I do have a custom drive shaft from the drive shaft shop. And this is the stock rear end for now. I do have a Ford 9 inch coming in the mail. Due to supply issues, I have to wait like two more months or something like that. But that's a Boyd's welding gas. Uh, uh, fuel tank there in the back. Uh, some rims uh, I got from a friend that he didn't use on his build. Uh, they're Co uh, Boyd Coddington rims. Um, there's a lot of custom stuff, but this is just a brief introduction of what I've done. I've been working on it many, many years, but there's a lot of custom stuff I have done, and I'll get more into that later. I'll do uh, individual videos of what I did, how I did it. Um, I'm learning as I go. This is my little control board here um, with my Pac-Man startup box. Uh, Arizona High Test made that for me, but I'm eventually gonna move that all into the cab so I can mount the uh, fenders on and get everything lined up. But that's it. I uh, hope you enjoy my videos and I will post some more and I'll have some videos of my Volvo here uh, shortly. All right, have a good day.